there you go look at that welcome back welcome back how y'all doing how y'all doing um as the title says yeah as the title says we're gonna finally get into digimon survive today a kind of a visual novel so it could get kind of a lot of me reading um i try not to be narrating too much but uh we'll just kind of enjoy it i know it's kind of a strategy game i haven't watched anyone play it yet because i don't want to get it ruined for myself i've been wanting to play it for a cool minute now um i know i said that in the last stream but i do mean it genuinely i've uh <laughs> been following this game for a long time uh, but it is what it is um delays change of a direction on the game it is what it is games do that all the time um this one is no different but i'm surprised it got so much flack on the internet though um i feel like it was attacked a lot for the the way the game went down i don't know i guess we'll find out ourselves right mm -hmm. like always stream beats playing in the background I can never go without a stream without bumping stream beats because i can't bump anything else because of copyright <clears throat> youtube it is what it is all right so also in the title i also put uh, a little something else i want to talk about um the plan is today so i know digimon survive is a 20 hour game so maybe finish like two chapters today give or take chapter and a half maybe um but there's something else i wanted to get to just quickly um i understand this is a gaming channel right we talk about games we talk about um we play video games on this channel uh, we react to some of the um some of the games that get announced uh, presentations um we do kind of recaps of stuff that happens like i know this week pokemon's gonna have their presentation their trainer presentation whatever it's called um probably talk about um most likely scarlet and violet and probably we'll talk about some of the apps that they've kind of talked about throughout the years well maybe hopefully but for sure scarlet and violet and i will do a reaction to that and that will come out wednesday well tomorrow tomorrow yeah. um i know it's at 6 a.m so if you want to watch it yourself go ahead um i'll probably drop a reaction to it five o'clock ish i get out at work at 2 30 so kind of already have the thumbnail ready so all it all i gotta do is record edit and we're good to go um also i got a new monitor so i kind of got this big thing going it's a nice little thing i got myself have myself a nice little tree um just like i told you guys this one uh, you guys can't really see it, but i have one right here broken uh, show you guys. that's that's whack all right <clears throat> back to what i was saying <sighs> i know this is a gaming channel i know that i understand that 100 percent. but i have other interests as well i have a uh, a huge Profuse, profuse. Maybe that's not the perfect word, but I have a big love for football. I have since I was a kid, and, and my favorite team is the Miami Dolphins. Not sure if you heard the owners doing some whack, whack stuff. Um, a lot of my friends ask me all day, "How do I feel about it? How do you feel about it? Your team's poverty. Your team's trash. Y'all can't even." tamper properly y'all paying to lose oh all day so i'm just gonna i want to give you guys how i feel give you guys my my insights um fuck deshaun watson no i'm just kidding uh, steven ross can go somewhere else i, I want him gone surprisingly i wasn't really upset about it i'm not gonna lie to you I wasn't really upset, right? It just sucks that we lost the 
first round pick. I know there was a lot of plans going into next season that hey, if Tua doesn't su succeed, he falters. He doesn't fulfill the opportunity he's given, right? That we can use some of these picks to draft a guy or maybe trade for someone. You know, Lamar Jackson most likely is going to be on the market. Or you don't, you never know. This year we had Russ, we had Matt Ryan, Deshaun, all get moved. Tua could probably have gotten replaced. But now our ammunition has been taken for a stupid reason. But for me, just the way I think, right? The reason I'm not upset so much about the actions, just the fact, like the results, because, bro, this guy's been doing this for years. Like, people act like um, when we got an Indomitian suit, we got him day one, night one, minute one. You don't think he had something to do with uh, or he didn't tamper a little bit with that? He gave him the biggest contract of all time. Um, the Brian Flores thing. I, I, unlike a lot of the fan base, think Brian Flores should have been gone last year. I, I, don't, I did not want him here. I don't know how he got a third year. He should have been gone the second season. Um, after that playoff loss. I, I truly thought he, he should have been done. And I think after the seven game losing streak, after we started one to seven, he should have been done. I, I don't know how he lasted that long. But all the things that happened with the Brian Flores um, firing, how it went down, how he got indicted, how he had that letter going circulating. It's just like, and the fact that he talked to Tom Brady before the, before he even went to free agency, I think it was they reported the summer of 2019, so that would put him at the year before they lost to Tennessee in the wild card round. We yeah, in the wild card round. Um, how do you do that? Like, are you just not? Are you done? Um, but he's got a pattern of this shenanigans, man. Um, I can go back a couple years in the past, man. You know, keeping Tannehill for too long. Jeff Ireland sticking around because he's a yes man. Um, Chris, most recent Chris Greer stuck around. Like, I didn't want him gone. But after the optics of last year, yeah, he should have probably have probably lost his job too. Um, there's a lot of things this Steven Ross guy has done. And it's just, it's unfortunate that it finally caught up this year because I feel like there was so much great happening right um, I personally think that the Dolphins are going to be really good despite all this is going on I think they're going to be really good but cloud of the shadow of doubt is now on top of them right um, now people are going to be thinking that the Dolphins are a laughing stock even though I've always said Miami is a poverty franchise they're 100% the Dolphins are a poverty franchise. Despite what anyone might tell you, they are truly, truly, truly a poverty franchise. They haven't been very good in recent years. And, sorry guys. Um, they haven't been very good in recent years. Quite frankly, they've been, in my lifetime, since I became a Dolphins fan, they've made the playoffs what I uh, watched them in three and but they've been in four since Dan Marino um what else they've only had like four or five winning seasons throughout that time I know they went and they had like a nine and seven season and a ten and six season with uh Nick Saban but besides him Dave Weinstead um Tony Sperano, rest his soul, and you know Brian Flores was the most successful, and they're all like, just like yeah, Tony Sperano, like rest in peace, but like he's still mid, he was still a mid coach, like this, the Dolphins are a poverty franchise, and and a guy got 
bought the Dolphins and didn't know what he was doing. And, like, we're all supposed to be surprised that this happened. Like, no. Like, this guy's been a joke. Like, he's a joke. He is a joke. And it's unfortunate because, like, I don't live in Miami, so I don't have to deal with the torment. But I would imagine being over there might not be the greatest thing in the world. It sucks. That's all I can say, man. It sucks. But it's expected. I, on the other hand, did not forget about all this, so I kind of knew it was going to come. It sucks with the first round pick because when I say the, the draft pick being taken upsets me, it isn't the fact that um, we lost the pick. It's just the fact that Chris Greer did all that work, all that maneuvering for Trey Lance and the the Eagles trade, which ended up being what Smith and Waddle basically they got swapped. All that worked for nothing. And now say nothing happens with the two a thing. And we now we have no out. Now we have no solution. And it's just gonna be a pattern of poverty. And it's all because of a guy who doesn't know what he's doing and is afraid to put men around him that know what they're doing. The worst part is that it, once it all came out, right? Once it was all announced, you know, it was around like the Deshaun Watson stuff came out six in the morning, right? Um, that stuff came out around like 8.39 ish uh, Pacific Standard Time. He came out with a statement and basically said like, no, 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 guys, like, I didn't do none of that stuff that Brian Flores said. And whatever they're blaming me of, I don't know what happened, but I prefer to just accept it. You didn't do it, but you're going to accept it. Sure. I have a statement. I say all the time where there's fire, where there's smoke, there's fire. And this one reeks of some definite real black smoke, man. This is bad and it is what it is. As a Dolphin fan, you just got to accept it. Whatever. Tua, go do your thing. In Tua, we trust. Until 2023, I guess. I don't know. There's that kid from uh, Oklahoma this night. Well, he used to be in Oklahoma. Caleb Williams went to USC. Or my boy Bryce Young. Roll ties, baby. Roll ties. I am an Alabama boy, too. I'm not from Alabama, but I love Alabama. Love that program for a long time. They've been whooping everybody's ass for a long time. I will just say that. Um, so it hurt to get Bryce Young. Um, last but not least, Deshaun Watson. I don't got nothing to say about that, to be honest. Look, at the end of the day, he is. it is what it is. It happened. I think same thing where there's smoke there's fire and the lawyer or the judge even said he committed a crime right he committed a crime it is what it is but she still gave him six games I'm okay with that I'm not accepting SA this this notion that it's a non-violent SA like, that's weird. Like, I've never really heard that terminology before. But I'm not a lawyer. I'm not. I didn't go to law school. I don't know nothing about that. To me, though, just take your suspension. You didn't get prosecuted. Move on with your life. Just don't make a mistake. That's how I feel. I, I am completely on board with the whole second chances thing. Um, look, you didn't play football last year. You're going to be rusty. You're probably not going to play the six games. You're not going to be in the building for, what, a month and a half? I think their bye week is... It's probably like week eight or something. So I think he will be fine. He won't miss a bye week. But he's going to he's gonna be rusty. He's going he's gonna to take his lumps. He's going to... I think with the fact that he's going to walk into every stadium despite... Uh, Except the the Cleveland Browns one, which is Baker's house. I'm no, just kidding. Um, I I don't know what it's called. I can't. It doesn't really ring a bell. But he's gonna go into every stadium, being booed out the building, being yelled every obscenity in the book. I think that's gonna be the biggest punishment. 
Um, and also, I want to beat him at 100%. So, week 10 versus Cleveland is going to be a big game for us. And I hope Tua beats him. <laughs> because this will be your only chance as a starter to beat him, for sure. And we definitely need that one. Because a lot of the games on our schedule are going to be really hard. I, I am not a... Uh, I am a giant Dolphins fan, but I'm also not a delusional fan. And I do know that there's a very, 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 very high chance that we start the season like one and three. We're gonna have to win some of these 50-50 uh, games, you know, like Chargers, the 49ers, the Browns. Uh, what else is there? The Packers, no, I'm just kidding. Well, maybe without Devonte, X don't have to cover him. Eh, whatever, still Aaron Rodgers though. But some of those 50-50 games, uh, all your division games, <laughs> you at least need to show out. You know, this uh, going four and two in the division, it's not gonna cut it because it hasn't cut it the last two seasons. I don't know. I'm just, I'm just being a hater, I guess. But look, all the people that are that are saying Deshaun Watson deserved more, how much more? What, what, what more do you want him to suffer from? You're still gonna go to the games. You're still gonna throw stuff at the guy you're still gonna hate him you're still gonna tweet at him on twitter which i think he's got off social media now especially with the whole you know he can't <laughs> he can't hit up massage therapist no more and <laughs> definitely can't be doing that but uh i just anytime i hear he needs more well, what's more to you what, what more do you want he's missed a year and a half of a game that he's loved and it's his job i'm at I like to put myself in the shoes of some of these players when we start talking like that. Cause like, imagine you, imagine you being told you did something wrong, we think. So just go sit at home. And then the following year, hey, um, I, we still don't know if you did something wrong. I think you did, but I'm not sure. But you know what? Go sit another month and a half at home. Yeah. It's kind of weird, right? I mean, come on. The guy's been through a lot. He's made a mistake. Let him recover from it. Except Stephen Ross. He sucks. <laughs> he sucks. I hate that guy. Um, all right. Well, that's enough of me just ranting about the Dolphins. Deshaun, if you have anything else, let me know. The only team I won't talk about is the Rams because I hate the Rams. Kind of. Kind of kidding. Kind of not. Kind of don't. Even though, you know what? It's funny. I, there, I wish I could sh pull up the clip, but I have to look through my hard drive. But there's a clip of me saying that the Rams would win the Super Bowl in, like, November. And then there's also a clip of me saying that the 49ers would get to the NFC title game in October. I think it was October. I'm not too sure. I think it was. So, hey. I know a little bit about football. Just a little bit, right? I'm sound dumb when we talk about football all right let me take, connect this headphone and let's dig into this digimon survive game all right no, no more heavy topics we're tired we're tired of that all right so digimon survive i don't know what we're getting ourselves into i know it's a visual novel game i know it's a tax strategy a tactical strategy game oh, that was hard to say um, and I know there's three different paths. On stream, I will attempt one. Unless there's a new game that comes out. Or unless there's nothing that intrigues me enough to play on stream, then I'll probably try for a second run. But our first run will definitely try to be as good as we can. To the best of our abilities. Um, I'll try to be a nice guy. Um... So, let's just get into it. Let me strap in the headphones. Let me strap them in. Let me turn off the music. And let's switch scenes. That's always kind of the annoying part, all right? Not annoying in terms of just, oh, this is annoying. It's just like, you would think I'd be more prepared. Because I've been doing this for a little while now. Alright, well, uh, audio, good, visual, good, camera, 
Alright, we'll be alright. Alright, let's go. I haven't turned the game on. I just installed it yesterday and been waiting to play it. So like I said, Saturday. I think I said Saturday. So streaming schedule set. Time, not yet. But I will make myself like a calendar thing. Or not a calendar, but kind of like a weekly update thing that I can update every week. What game we're doing or what we're planning on. Like this Friday, definitely planning on a you laugh, you lose. How that's going to work, not viewer thing. Uh, it's going to be more just friends. Unless you want to join in. Maybe I'll do a second one. Maybe I can do like a monthly thing. Um, hit me up. Hit me up on on uh, Twitter or something if you want in on it. But our, my friends will be involved in it. It's going to be kind of a, a TikTok version because YouTube lifts to to not enjoy uh, reactors on uh, English. There you go. thought you had to click it for some reason. React content on YouTube. Well, YouTube Live. Well, whatever. We'll be all right. But we will do that on Friday, so that'll be kind of fun. I know I talked to you guys about doing more content stuff, so there's that. We won't just be a gameplay channel, even though, I mean, we do play games here. Now, right, let's see. Anything that you need to know about? No. Let me know if the audio is not the best. Sometimes I don't really check it but nevertheless here we go so like i said goal is be a good guy as much as i can all right let's go hopefully i don't have to narrate too much looks like uh i might have to I'm gonna let the beauty of the game just play out, all right? I don't want to ruin it. So I'm guessing the uh, boy and girl are getting stuck in the digital world, maybe? What is this? It looks like Gabumon for some reason. What is that? Hmm. <laughs> Renamon, maybe? It does look like Renamon, actually. I won't lay by hand on them. Okay. Alright. Damn, homeboy's scared, scared. wonder what's going on, though, for sure. Alright, tip. Talk with friends. Oh, okay, so that's our Digimons. Okay. Look at that. Koi. Some of the mechanics and battle the order. Alright. Hmm, hmm, hmm. Okay, rotate the camera. Zoom in and out. Alright. It's also important to switch over the camera to get the grasp of the situation. Now move. Alright. Doesn't seem too difficult. Let's prepare to attack. Mm, here we go. Use the skills. SP. Alright. Passive skills are special abilities that are always on. How each one works. First, let's have. Uh, okay. Choose attack or skill list. We're okay. Okay, so range, area. I'm guessing the range is how far the attack goes. Hmm. Alright, attack. Elemental affinities. Critical hit, percent and more. Also shown. So, okay, okay, cold, cold, cold. Critical counter attack. Percentage in particular. Important. This is sure. Okay. So let's attack with Renamon. Choose an end turn. Alright, alright. If attack you take more damage to attack from the side or from some so okay. 
All right, so I could face directions. I don't know what the strategy would be in that, but uh, guess we'll be finding out. I'm gonna check up on other units in battle, so I'll switch over to get more. You could free anywhere on the screen. Try putting. Oh, okay, so I could pretty much. Oh, okay, there you go, there you go. So you get to see its levels. Over the curve of the units, it's huge. It's just going up here, right? Okay. And then triangle basically opens up to. You can't see it right now. Hmm, okay. Alright. Let's move Gobblemon behind. Because that's what it's telling me to do. You choose to attack. And then we'll hit him with the. Just a regular. Oh, blue blaster. Alright, alright. Alright, alright. You do extra damage by performing a rear attack. Flank attacks also do more damage. Who wants to do? Oh, okay. Point it forward so it doesn't attack me. Alright, so I basically just learned the mechanics and the. How to attack and all the the good good good. Oh, come on, guys, we got this. Hmm. Sure. Alright, so what's going on? Okay, so the girl's name is Miyuki. Remember that. Haru. Or is those names like the, the... No, I can't be. Never mind. Maybe they happen to you. Get back safe on your own somehow. Alright, alright. Alright, so she's grabbed by a bunch of shadow. Shadow Digimon, I'm assuming. Of some sort. Miyuki. But I can't, obviously. Young man, we got this. <laughs> well, what an interesting opening. Okay, no matter what. Alright. So, I'm assuming a sister of some sort? Getting attacked by some Digimon. Interesting. But I thought they said the main character gets sucked in. Ah, we'll find out right now. Alright, cutscene. Main character. Hmm. Minoru? Got it. I should probably be writing these down so I don't forget. Uh, I'll figure it out later. You, who's that? Okay. Guessing that's Miyu. Got it. I feel like I'm watching an anime with you guys. Yuki? <laughs> What's going on? Oh, 
Holy snap. I wonder what that is. Hmm, a professor of some sort? Or grandpa. Alright. Wait. I thought they go into the digital world, not... Take a step back. Take a step back. We'll find out in a minute. I think that's another character of the of the pack. Obviously, that trio for sure. She's singing, but it's quite lovely. But that looked like the digital world that they've been showing, so it has something to do with it. Takuma, so this is camp, huh? Hmm, look at that. Alright. So the main character's name is Takuma, got it. We're holding in an abandoned school in the mountains here going leave it up to us to spend our school break going to another school all right not that this school is anything like the one we usually go to best friend got it sup Takuma hey, we're checking out that one. Okay. Alright. 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 Ooh, look at that. Homeboy's flirting. That knucklehead over there is Minoru, and the girl lecturing him is Oi. 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 Eo. O. Eoi. I'm just gonna go with L. <laughs> Maybe it's not right, but I'm still gonna go with it. I didn't talk to him much at school. Oi. It's cool. She came here from a different school. Got to know each other more here at camp, and that's mostly thanks to Minoru. The three of us ended up doing our extracurricular activities together all right so they are kind of like the trio of friends maybe i should break things up here as you play the game you will occasionally be asked to make choices sure two to four options to choose from okay i left right vector infinity and with different characters your feeling with other characters influence the battle backups they give during combat deferring results if you treat everyone equally as opposed to focusing on one person Check the feelings for me. Okay, got it. I'll check things out. Now I'll ask the homegirl. Aoi-san, what do you do in the course? Ooh. Today is this and this. I'm here. 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 Like, I don't want to narrate over the game. I feel like that's disrespectful to the voice actors that took time out of their days, but you know, I don't actually know what they're saying. 
I just don't want you guys to be reading the entire time, but it is what it is. Alright, alright, I'm a babysitter now, huh? Interesting. <laughs> Looks like Minoru noticed something on his phone. Alright. Hmm. Probably from that earthquake that they were talking about during the cutscene. See, I pay attention. いや、そういうもだけどさ、ちゃんと見てよ。これ今日見学に行くところの近所だよ。うーん。これ本当だわ。今日の予定は。You could feel the tension in the air around here. Someone must have shared the news. I think that's what I'm gonna do. Anytime he's having like an inner monologue, I'll narrate that. Everything else, you guys can, can kind of enjoy the, the Japanese dialogue from the voice actors. I just think it's very respectful like that. Shuji is an alumni of Oi School, so he came to help chaperone. Shuji, got it. Gotta get that one embraced in here. Off we go. Got it. Ah, He seems like it. Very much the, the, the bossy boss. If that's fair. That's got a point. Minoru君は私が上級生ってことも忘れてはいないかしら。青井さんも俺が下級生ってこと忘れてない？もっとさ、こうこらってさ、上級生活で深くて叱ったりしてみようぜ。Alright. Sure. All right, all right. I just want to know how they integrate that whole like, like, do we travel in this game? Or? Okay, so we go from point A to point B and then listen to more dialogue. So what I do know is like seventy percent dialogue, so probably won't talk a lot during these streams, but I'll try to do the best I can to interact with y'all, the best I can. Oh wow, cherry blossoms are in full bloom. Everyone stopped on the way to the landmark to take in the flowers. Oops. Oops. The flowers sure are pretty. What can we take a breather? Let's be nice. Like I said, this is our nice run. The best that I can be, of course. Alright, got it. Caught up. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. Saki and Ryu? Hmm, wonder who they are. Gotcha. The guy shooting daggers at everyone is Ryu. And an, an older kid from another school. The girl who's all smiles there is Saki. Her looks are famous in the grade below ours. Got it. They must be here to enjoy the cherry blossoms too. Hmm. Then again, I could be wrong in Ryu's case. <laughs> Alright. I feel like it's just are watching me read. 
What the hell is the other? Haha, I thought as much. We're not in any real rush. Might as well look around here some more. Uh -huh, all right. As you play the game, we'll be presented with choices of where to go. All right. Talking pretty much. You can switch between targets. So, oh, okay, so I don't even need to like. I could just pretty much do this. Target leads to an important story. Mark with the. To get them to sign what to do next. Okay, so pretty much ignore her. Because that will progress the story. I could talk to these guys though. Aw, oh, they don't. The weather makes you want to sit down, take a load off for a while. Alright, so that kind of stuff I think I'm going to be ignoring for now. But I'll take a, a gander looking at some of these. Uh... Alright, so all he does is talk. Okay. Listen closely. I can hear the sound of brown one. Ever hear something like that? Interesting. Interesting. I'll just continue the story. Let's not stall. Curl up. You're behind and died. Search me. Let me guess, Suji and the teachers gave you flack for that cheerful di disposition. <laughs> All right. You don't know what you're talking about. Sure, sure, whatever you say. Come on, it's time to go. All right. All right. All right. All right. <laughs> uh, he don't really do much. Let's talk to Minoru real quick. Let's see what he has to say. You know, there's leaves of the cherry blossoms that are poison. And leaves growing underneath them. Huh, is that right? Wait, don't people eat those sometimes? Well, sure, they're fine if you pick them first. Huh, you sure know some weird things, man. Interesting. So I'm guessing the best friend character. All right, let's talk to Ryu and let's move on with our day. Wait, how long do you plan on following me around? What do you expect? Who knows what you'll do if I take my eyes off you, Ryu? So you're my supervisor now? Isn't she like a year younger than him? It's kind of weird. Alright, alright, don't gotta be so aggressive, buddy. Okay, so what else is there left to oh, okay, so just talk to this homie. Those who get along way better than I figure. More like Saki get along with anyone. Ryu is a real pain too. She must be kind of a saint. Now is that any way to speak about him? All of us need to work together. Friendship. Power of friendship, baby. Never heard anything come out of his mouth that wasn't a complaint about something. I can kind of relate, to be honest. It's like looking at how I used to be. Kind of embarrassing. You sure he's older? Their past self. Is that something a middle schooler is supposed to say? Again, I suppose an adolescent boy would say such things. Man, there's going to be a lot of reading. Which I think I might not be doing. I'm just going to let it play and read. Okay. Alright, let's move on. There's one more. I think it's got to talk to I. Yes, sir. Mm hmm. Okay. Two cents from her, I quite like it. Radiant, don't you think? So she could go a little bit over the Let's look out for her. Wait, that's her sister? Nah, 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 I read that wrong. What? Want to hear about that right now? 
I wonder if there's like a button that I can switch it to like a like an auto auto play. That'd be kind of cool. It was a normal conversation on a normal day with some friends. Well, normal other than the camping part. All right, all right. At least that's what I thought. Oh no. Here we go. Here we go. I thought that was go time, but I guess not. We cleared the tree line path when we headed up the trail. <coughs> oh, look at that. まあ、いいかな。どうやらここから先は。ああ、本当だ。立ち入り、もう少し。Related sites of the kimono, kimono gami, kimono gami. The heck is that? Sono kimono gami te no wa. Ore ni wa pinto koe. Answer it for me. I mean the beast gods. Shita ga nai wa. Koko wa hito mazu hiki kaisu shika nai no ka shira. Hiki kaisu mai ni nani ga atta no ka. Asoko de hanas. Let's see what the people gathering in front of the police have to say. Probably nothing good about us. We're just a little bunch of group of teenagers. Maybe I should ask the police officer what's going on. Got it. Got it, boss. I will do just that. Excuse me, did something happen here? There was a landslide up ahead. Okay, so probably from the earthquakes from earlier. The one they read about online earlier. Hey, hey. Great minds think alike. Nice, so what do I do now? Talk to a reporter? No, that's not a reporter. What are you talking about? Let's talk to her. Oh dear, we can't proceed with things like this. Yeesh, so much for exploring the great outdoors. Guess camp is canceled. I don't know about all that. Still, perhaps we should turn back for now. All right, all right. Let me talk to Minoru. A landslide for for really reals man i think the guy that went ahead are okay no childish jibs no childish jibs i suppose you wouldn't be so callous as to joke at a time like this got it of course even i know when to watch my mouth sometimes maybe <laughs> okay all right all right all right all right not her do I talk to police officer to ask about our friends? Our friend non friends. Our friend non friend non friends. Alright, the arena head is off limits. Since we can't get through here, what's the plan? Should we head back for now? So I'm guessing they just move ahead and don't listen to nobody. No way, don't talk out of your ass or you'll regret. Huh, I can hear someone kicking up a fuss. Hmm. Were you getting beat up? Oh, I guess correctly. Ryu and Saki over there. Knew they went ahead. I guess they took that long way. More important, who's that girl? Okay, so that girl is Yui, right? Or What's her name? What's her name? <laughs> but she's like that sister that ran away, right? Earlier? Kimono Kimono Rium A sacred shrine to the Kimono Gami So that's a sacred beast Sacred beast is Kind of Building, I guess 
no place for someone to just wander around. All right. Kimono Kimono Rium. I'm guessing like a, a museum for the kimono. I already forgot what they're. This is too many big words for me to read. <laughs> they worship that stuff to the bone. He's a nasty individual. I wonder how old she is if she has like a, a brother being like a guardian, I guess. Hmm. Got it. Alright, so they worship a god and they have a shrine. Got it. Hmm. But only known to the locals. Playing a, a playing a video game here. Can you roast? Mew. No, okay. Oh, I got it. Mew. <laughs> Alright. So I'm guessing this shrine is how they all end up in the digital world? Or kind of like a like a past version of the town, I'm guessing? ひ、戻っても <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry guys I'm telling y'all It's like you guys are watching an anime with me Alright um, what do y'all think? I really don't think any of these are bad per se, but they are kids, so I would say let's have some fun. But I feel like that'd be kind of, I don't know, douchey or something. Whatever, I'm just gonna go with it. Eee, she didn't like that. Whoa, chill out, buddy. <laughs> chill out, buddy. Okay, kimono gamu. Did I just make a mistake? You can't, it's only the first chapter. I don't know what's going on, alright? I don't know what's going on. I don't know このまま校舎まで引き返すか。それはそれで面倒なんだけどな。それよりも何があるかわからないし、やっぱり咲さんたちを追いかけないと。そうだね。あと。All right, let's go follow him. 
So we're going to a shrine for the kimono gamis. Kimono gamis. Yes. Which are sacred beasts that the town knows. Yes. Saki Ryu and the little kid Mew. We ended up at a tunnel. Not a soul to be seen around us and no other pass. Do they head through here? なんだか暗くて薄気味悪いトンネルだな。ああ。それに何だか。だぞ、クリーピー。ちょ、ちょっと。変なこと言うのはやめて。やめてしょ。そんなこと言ったりを探さないとでしょ。さきさんたち<
nothing to be done about it. I'll help pursue them next time. I'm not not worried. No worries. Come on, guy. Reading was never our strong suit, huh? I'll talk to her. Am I really going to go through this tunnel? I don't see any other way. This is our only option, right? Well, yes, but... Uh, you're not afraid of the dark, are you, Oi? Just, just a bit. Creeps me out. Just a little bit. Hey, why are you talking about this? We have to bring Saki and the others right, others back right away. And now all of a sudden, Minoru. Minor. <laughs> Minor you. <laughs> Minor you are. <laughs> Boy, just. <laughs> wow. I really just did that. Minor you are. <laughs> Boy, just when I thought you were going to die of boredom. Things, things are getting interesting. Are you going to join the search? Who cares about that? This tunnel, a lost shrine. I smell adventure, don't you? Uh, I think I see what you mean. Right. Might as well look for some ruins while we look for those jokers. Ruins. I think the joke might be on you. All right. So I've talked to all of them. Let's go get some Digimon now. Oh, <laughs> I thought it was a good scene. Oh. 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 あいついつもフラフラと勝手に出歩く癖があってな。で、what Definitely the brother, okay. あ、そうだ。あったのか。え、俺たちが見たこは、そうそう、ビアン8 ちょっと見るか。いや、でも、あれを人見知りとか守ってあげたいとかは違うだろう。お前らの評価なんてどうでもいい。But what's his name though? Mewはどこに行ったんだ？Give me a name, homie. えっと、ごめんなさい。実は私たちも人を探している途中なの。俺たちと一緒にキャンプに来てるやつとさっき神社に向かってってさ。それで俺たちはそいつらを連れ帰りに向かうところなんだ。そうか。また実は俺たちよく知らないんだ。いや、そうみ。あ、だったら俺が道案内しよう。ここで生まれ育ったわけじゃないにせよ。もう何年か住んでるからな。その神社の場所なら知っている。任せてくれ。俺は実の主事。I
What is this guy talking about? Come on, dog. Let's be mature adults. Well, technically, if they're in grade school, they'd be a little immature. Fair enough. What's going on? What's going on? Yuki? Oh, oh, here we go now. It's go time, boys. It's go time. You know what it means when it snows. I'm excited now. So they're gonna go into the tunnel and it's snowing. I'm guessing the world's transitioning to the digital world. Come on, leader, at least tell us to do something. Not just stand around. Be a good leader for once. Be like Tai Chi. Don't be a Davis. <laughs> I grew up with those, all right. I was around during the 90s. Is this still being used? The tunnel is cold. Let's ask. So I'm guessing the red that's on that top right corner. You guys didn't see it, but there's some red that popped up. I think that might be bad. I think a big, a bad um, ending or a bad answer. But hey, man, we'll be alright. Come on, leader, tell us what to do. I'm a little nervous. I don't know what's to come. But I know it, it's going to be good. I know it's going to be good, I hope. <laughs> なんか探検みたいでワクワクしてこない。ほら、遊びじゃないんだぞ。でも確かにこれじゃ危ないな。そうだ。また。怖え。ああ、もうやめてよ、ミノラ君。What's what going on? いきなり大声出すなよ。こっちまで驚いたじゃないか。ごめん。でもこんなの見たらさ。これは a sacred rope? What's that? こんなところにどうして? うーん。もしかしたらここは神聖な場所として祀られているのかもしれない。Kimono Alright, alright, I gotta remember that. そういえばさっき Retribution. So when the kids do something bad, the village retaliates. That's what I'm guessing. Yes. Good leader. Good leader. Someone's gonna lose their leadership position real quick. Jesus, you gotta be quick on your feet. Leaders are quick. They know they can make a mistake, but they'll still be willing to make a mistake. Take any risk. 
But that is the making of a good leader. Not whatever that guy just did. Alright, slow folks, slow down. Something is kind of sporing in the air. I wonder what that's all about. <laughs> what is all that? Yeah, they're a lot different than those cherry blossoms, that's for sure. You can't. You can't Okay. Sure. Maybe there's something to look into. What is what a suspicious looking forest? I should look around or maybe talk with the others. Hi, Captain. Let's see. Let's look at the spider lilies. What's this? There's a bunch of stuff floating in the air. So I talked about earlier. I think it's those whatchamacallit spores. I never heard of red spider lilies doing something like that. These things aren't bad for us, are they? Flowers like these could be found anywhere. I mean, they look pretty normal. Alright, alright. No. Let's talk to Shuji to see what he has to say. Mr. Leader. Normal weather occurs in this area. Maybe it's localized sun snowstorm. First I've heard of something like that. The blizzard was no joke. Then there are red spider leaves which only blossom in the fall. I'm telling you man, spring is in the air. Hmm, what the heck is this? What is it? Okay, so clearly I just talked to him already. Alright, he don't want to talk to me. He don't really fuck with me. Let's talk to her. And that should finish this area. This area, I have a bad feeling about it. Something's not right. Not right how? Um, I'm sorry. I can't quite put it into words. Take the flowers. They should be pretty. But they're giving me the creeps. More than anything. Hmm. She's not capping. It's kind of weird. Oi, Isogo. Soon you will have to let's go to the shrine. Anna, you will be welcome. In this area, the people are not here. The temple is Yes, I would assume. Probably so. This is the shrine of the Kamonogamis. I don't know why I said it like that. Y'all know what I mean. Pretty run down though. I thought it would be like, you know, a lot more prettier since it's kind of like the shrine for the beast, the sacred beast. But I, I mean, I, I guess. I'm guessing this is rural japan maybe not entirely the digital world i'm not, i don't know we'll figure it out we'll figure it out i'm just guessing here kaido said people never come here but it's breathtaking it's also kind of eerie hmm. could anyone expect 
さかむしろ絶対に近づくなって強く言われてるぜはい He seems like the bad boy, the badass of the crew サキさんたちの姿はどこにもないわ The main in distress さっき人影は見えたんだけどなどこ行ったんだろう The best friend character Starting to get their their characteristics a little bit could they be? Okay. So does that mean I get to move around a little bit? Kind of scatter about? No, clearly not. Why would I even think that? Do I not get to talk to anyone? No, let's just go into the shrine. Let's go check into it. Let's go see what it's got. Let's go see what this is all about. Okay. No, Minoru, no. What are you doing? <laughs> huh. Minoru snapping tons of pictures on his phone, huh? Didn't know he was into that. What kind of statue? Okay. Alright, leader. Sure. Oh, more pictures. A cyber Leoman, maybe? <laughs> Mr. Leader just getting people in trouble for having fun. Jesus. Sure. Have to look for Saki and the others. Still, this place is so weird. I'm not surprised Minoru wanted a few mementos. Mementos. Right. Not mementos, like, uh. Take more over here. No, it's. Enough photos. Harmony changed. So I'm guessing that's a good thing. Enough with the photos, Minoru. All of us need to focus on the search. Let's find them as fast as we can. Sure, this place makes the most. Sure. So harmony is the path that I'm trying to accomplish. That would be like the good path, right? All right. All right, Kaito. Lead us to the shrine. Let's see what we got going. Oh, there's statues in the shrine. That's <笑>あらいあらいあらいもう見るくんてばそれにしてもここって今回の課外学習の伝承にまつわる場所なのかしらチャンスそうどうだろうなさっき話した通りここには足を踏み入れるなって言われてるし あまり詳しいことは知らないただ地元では、ここじゃ神隠しが起きるなんて話もあるぜそうなの怖い話ねボタヘクザー風で木か何かが軋んだ音だろう that was not just the trees. This guy's tripping. Mr. Cool Guy over here. Just don't want to be scared. 
All right, the blizzard might not be the only thing we have to worry about. Let's look for clues. All right, so now I get to do ooh, some exploration. All right, let's go. Let's see what this is all about. As you play the game, you will need to travel to location on the map to advance the story. You will slowly gain access to more locations by pro progressing through the game. All right. Spider Lily Forest Unlocked. And the old shrine. Switch over to visit or switch over to list view to see a location's information on the bottom right of the screen. Got it. Also pay attention to the icons displayed on the list. Okay. People's head means there's someone at that location. Their character icon is displayed on the bottom right corner. Okay. So that's where you have Minoru and Shuji. Got it. The, char the character's head with the exclamation point lets you know if you talk to the person who's there, it will advance the plot. Gotcha. Other icons will show you where to find an important clue or an alert to an enemy. Gotcha. So that's where we battle. So keep all of these in mind as you play through the game. Got it. All right. So let's. Okay. All right. So let's go to the shrine first. Talk to Shuji and Minoru, and then we'll try to progress the story. Because I feel like today we're only going to be able to get through one chapter. So let's just let's just kind of take all of it in, right? As you play the game, you'll be presented with a situation where you have to explore. In this mode, you'll talk to others or investigate the world to find clues to progress. Clues you need. The clues you need may not always be nearby. Open your map and try to search others areas too. You can always use the map to travel between areas while exploring. Got it. Open the map with L2. Gotcha. Makes it easy. I didn't know that. Clues will be marked with the exclamation point during exploration too. So keep an eye out for them. Looks like right now there aren't any clues in the area. Try searching somewhere else. I should talk to Minoru and Shuji about what to do next. Definitely talk to boss because he's apparently the leader. Right? Leader. Don't sprout too far, everyone. Stay where I can see you. Shuji's doing his best to keep us all together. Still. Get back here, Minoru. Listen to what I what I say. Sir, yes, sir. I do apologize, you bluster ship. Alright. Alright. Homeboy didn't really like that. Alright. Talk to him. See what uh, he has to say. Minoru's lost in historical photo ops. Better not interfere. Okay, so. This area has nothing for me. So. Let's go to the spider lily forest to progress the plot. All right. Hey, there's Kaito. Let's see if he found anything. Nah, we won't talk to her. Anything else? No, let's just talk to him. Let's just. Well, actually, let's just talk to her. See what she's got to say. Right? Why not? You've been pale for a while now. How are you holding up? Uh, well, if I'm being honest, it's taking all I've got to deal with this place. Pretty sure I said that correctly. I'm pretty sure. You shouldn't push yourself if you're scared. Okay. Thank you, but our friends might be facing something even scarier. You know? Saki Ryu, where are you? And Mew, don't forget about her. This is a three-person rescue mission. All right, let's talk to Kaito. Let's see where we go from here. Hey, Mew, where are you? I kind of run, Loki. All right. right. Otaku, Takuma, Takuma, Takuma. Have those guys found anything over there? Nothing yet. You found Mew? Nothing. Geez, where the hell is she? Saki and Ryu. 
are with her for sure. Here, I'll join the search. That'd be a great help. Thanks. Alright, so now that means I get to look around for stuff, right? No, there's nothing here. Alright, let's go check the map. Alright, let's check the shrine. It shows that there's something there. Let's check in with others. Alright, so she moved over here. That has nothing to do with it. Minoru. The minor you. Huh? What? What's in this picture? Yo, Takuma. You should take some pics around here too. Me? But why? The phone's picking up some weird stuff. Might be broken. Let's check yours. You sure your finger isn't in the shot? It ain't my finger, man. Something like that's all fuzzy on my pics. Go on, take some. Sounds like he's messing around. Guess I'll take a few test shots. Alright. Let's play the game. You'll be able to find clues using the camera on your phone. Camera icons on the left. You can take out your camera anytime while exploring. And that is with R2. Alright. Alright, chat. We got this. Pull out the camera. Alright, so... Nothing distortion. Try to focus on it to investigate. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Distortion. Shot. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Looks like a Gomomon. Is it? Yeah, yeah. Gomomon. Nothing here, but the camera definitely picks up. Picked up something. Hmm, what's this? What is it, Minoru? Hey, you guys. There's a weird thingy over here. Wonder what he's talking about. Weird thingy, who knows? Well, hey, don't just go off on your own. Mr. Leader being not so leadery. Guys, we're watching an anime here. We're watching the Digimon Survive anime. Put it that way. I haven't. Okay. おかしくないはずだが。Probably guessing Mew and the and the crew went in there. Yeah,あいつのことだ。きっとこの中に入ったんだろう。How did I know? How did I know that she was gonna be the Denzel in distress? Jesus, she already talks like it too. それに先だって入っちゃいそうじゃない。Saki's gonna be kind of like that cool chick and then Mew is gonna be the the fearless one I'm guessing right now Mew. I like how they put their fists on their chest like yeah, I'm gonna be brave I should do something about this. Don't go alone, Kaito. Harmony, yes. Alright, so that's two of three. That's two of three. Mota Mota Stera Reka. Muni Nani Katra Dosunda. I need to get as many harmonies as I can. So can I. Bokira Muiko. Oi! Saki! Alright, let's go look for Saki and Ryu. Very like, very eerie. 
like environment they're giving us. Hey, what is that? Hey, did I see Seedramon? Yeah, I did. I'm telling you, the Digimons are the Kimono Gamis. What's going on? People bend over a dragon and a chick. Looks like a mirror across the whole wall. This is really something else. Oh, mm. We're gonna try to not get swallowed up, buddy. Maybe it wasn't danger or retribution that caused people to close off this area. They might have been trying to protect this sacred place. Yes, we're here to find Saki, Ryu, and Mew. Well, what should we focus on? Find the others. Yes, sir. I hear footsteps. What's going on? Huh, I hear footsteps by the entrance. Could it be the others? Maybe. Whoa, whoa, who the heck is this guy? Oh, it's the guy from hmm? earlier. Hmm. I wonder who he is. Oh, Domo, Hajime Muste. Dare So Kimitachi, who go a height to a domino bashazo? None you steer in that. Ah, eto, son, book that you are. So you on to us. Conna to go there. None is tender. Okay, so he's a researcher. So the kimono, kimono gamis are an actual thing then. My theory is incorrect. Okay. A researcher. Okay. Interesting. Sure. Probably is right. <laughs> Okay, so he's not a professor. But he Okay, um Let's not get lost at the point that we're trying to accomplish here. So so this place is valuable enough to be worth researching, huh? Okay. I'm kind of lost here. What is a professor doing studying this place? That's only known to the locals. That's weird. I get why Kaido's feeling restless, but I'm really curious about this place. Same? Same? 
No idea if Saki and the others came here, but let's look around for some clues. So I'm guessing I'm gonna pull out the handy dandy camera phone. <laughs> this shrine is pretty weird. Maybe I should talk to the professor and inspect the mural. Let's pull out the camera. They said if I pull it out and see some some weird static, then it will do something, but guess not. All right, so talk to the professor. Let's see what he has to say. If you all come here to study the Kimonogami as well? Probably not. Yes, we're on a school trip, but we actually came to look for some missing people, our friends, and that guy's sister. Yeah, he came to look for her. And this, the Kimonogami shrine? Hope she hasn't been spirited away. What? Spirited away? Yeah, there's a legend about the Kimonogami passed down since ancient times. But it's more than a legend. The stories are true, you see. True, you say. Indeed. It was once custom to offer up local children to the beast gods as sacrifice. What? Okay. How awful. It's, it's, yeah, it's worse than that. <laughs> it was a desperate measure to ensure the harvest or perhaps to prevent disasters. Now, if only we could have done that for COVID. No, I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. It's a joke. It's a joke. Yet, these children did not die. Supposedly, they were taken somewhere unharmed. So that's what you mean, spirited away. Well, at least they didn't die. Uh, that's good. He made it seem like they did, you know what I mean? Yes, but the customs were lost to the ages. And this angered the ancient Kimonogami. Over time, such abductions were no longer a ritual sacrifice, but a curse or retribution. Many legends regard regarding such incidents have been passed down in this region. I place no faith in fairy tales, of course. There must be a scientific explanation. Some reason for the continuous disappearances since ancient times, I'm sure of it. I view this as a superstition or a mental block designed to escape from reality. He seems pretty worked up somehow. Is he mad or upset? Maybe? Hold on, let me take a second to really understand. So, the people that we were chasing ended up in the shrine. The shrine is supposed to be like a sacred... Um, how do I say this? It's supposed to be a sacred location for some beast what they call the Kimonogamis, but they're bad? I thought they they honored them. But maybe that's why the Kaido guy said that kids aren't allowed in there. But maybe that's why the girl was saying there's a lot of retribution from the village whenever people, huh. She did say something like that actually. Man, I just wasn't paying attention because she, okay, so Mew said early on that visitors are basically infuriate the village and the village retaliates in some way. But she didn't say none about the kidnapping kid stuff. That's a little weird. It's how it's like an out there thing. Just kind of hit me right now, but whatever. It'll be all right. We'll figure it out. We'll figure it out. We got a long way to go. All right. Um, all right. Let's keep going. I know you came looking for your friends, but I'm glad you came to see you. I'm glad you could see these legendary ruins. Interest in historical origins is a wonderful thing indeed. I support it wholeheartedly. Uh, um, thank you, sir. Mr. Leader's getting a little queasy, huh? Take a good look at this. Who knows? It may end up being of use to you all. Okay. All right. So, 
So we already saw Gomomon, right? So he... I'm pretty sure that's the name of the, the rock Digimon. Pretty sure. Um, so there are they? I'm confused. Are they in the digital world or not? I don't know, but that's a little weird. I'm a little lost. That's what I am. We'll look at the wall. Let's look at the wall. See what they got to say. Look at all these creatures. Cause see, I see Seedramon. I see, uh, I think his name is Bakuman, right? Maybe you guys would know, but it's like that little ghost Digimon. Um, I don't know. So these are all drawings of Kimonogami. They come in all shapes and sizes, huh? So see, I told, see, one of my guesses was correct. The Kimonogamis are the Digimon, but all right, all right, Rolf. let's stop thinking. Let's stop thinking. Hey, why do you think there are? Why do you think there are there so grammar? I thought I was I was uh the only one that I couldn't really write. Now I'm kidding. But uh, let's see. How do you say this? Why do you think there are so many kimonogami in the first place? Okay, it's probably just a translation thing. It's all right. It happens. Do you have a hunch, sir? Indeed, there are several possible explanations for all this. The unique terrain could explain the frequent incidents. Weak footholds, steep slopes, magnetic fields mess with the sense of direction, and overgrowth in flora and fauna. I'm gonna just go with that. Uh, like the red spider lilies then? Oh, from earlier. Good catch, good catch. I believe there's something in the minerals around here that makes people lose their way. Hmm. Creature of the Komonogami faith may have been altered somehow by this substance. I see. That's what. That wouldn't make sense. The wood, in theory. Okay, so. We've seen this. No. Nope. Okay, there you go. There you go. There you go. Pressing L1, R1 kind of allows you to go through the the area without having to actually go through it. In case you were asking how I did that. Discovery of the minerals has led to rapid development of this region in recent times. A sun population boom would naturally increase the number of missing persons. So what's up with that big dragon though? And the chick. Is she like the bad, the big bad of this game? Just a speculation. Dwindling resources, depopulation, likely obscure a word that I might struggle to say Abs abscond <laughs> y'all know what I mean in the night for such troubles likely abs absconding in the nights for s from such troubles I suspect the recent landslides are a result of unchecked development since the Showa era there's a lot of words man I'm struggling here but it's alright Unraveling the issue piece by piece allows for a logical explanation of the legend. At least that's what I think. Here we go with these with these uh guesses, man. Yes, learning from the past can help us in the present. She ain't wrong about that. Wow, thank you so much, Professor. What a wonderful and unexpected lesson we've learned here today. Yeah, muchas gracias, prof. <laughs> all right, all right. Hey, now show some respect. So, there's that. I wish I could look at more of it. Okay, so the professor seems to lead us to the continuing this plot. Um, what's with this wall? Is this writing or something? What's he looking at? 
Looks like the digital world's lettering, maybe? Hmm. Are these drawings or some kind of text? Yeah, something like that. There's all sorts of stuff on this crazy wall painting. I've never seen anything like it. Hmm. Something's written here. Maybe I can read it. Nope. Not a word of it. <laughs> Alright. It's just conjecture based on my investigation. But I think it says Agumon. Agumon. As my research progressed, I learned that each of the Kimonogami have their own names. Can I just call them Digimon already? And is that so? So there must be a bunch of those things running around. Voice actor can do their job now. Guessing that Saki or Mew. Huh? This girl, Mew-chan, My bad. Saki-chan, no way. Okay. Saki. Soto. Saki no jinja no hoda. I saw this going on. I wonder, I wonder. Probably like uh, one of the kimono gamis are attacking him. What's with this frog? さっきまでは。Right. いや、シカントか。いつや、カモノガミ。こんな山の中にいるわけないでしょ。so why can't they see him? That's the question. Because earlier they couldn't see the one that popped up on the phone either. Hmm. Oh, I'm guessing now they can see it. What if a lot of the statues they saw earlier were actual Digimons? They confused them. That's why they weren't seeing them. Boom. Just explain that. From the world. So I'm guessing he's going to attack? Well, at least we found them, right? I just... Alright, cool guy. Don't try to swing at it. Don't... Don't gotta be so violent now. <laughs> Jeez. Ryu was supposed to be like the badass and he's over here just being scared. I get it though. I'd probably be scared out of my mind too. Alright. So. 
This weird statue-like creature set its sight on the others. A creature? No, a monster. A digital monster. <laughs> Just kidding. What are you waiting for? What the hell over there? Okay. Sorry, when I start talking, I kind of lose track of what's going on. <laughs> Professor, he followed us from the shrine. We have to save those guys from this monster. Now, let's get closer and talk. Let's be brave. Let's not be like that guy, Shujin, who's supposed to be the leader. I know I keep pointing it out, but he's supposed to be the leader. Wait, did he just try to fight it? Yeah, I was wondering why didn't they just run? Like, I know it's like a visual novel style, but like, couldn't they just like dip the hell out? Alright, what a crazy situation we've gotten into. Why the heck is this happening? Oh, I don't know. Maybe because you're in a camp with seven to eight friends that you don't know, but you're kind of cool with some of them. And it snowed. Kind of the making of the digital adventure, right? <laughs> that rock monster's coming this way. I can't let it hurt. I... Ew. Why would you just... If he doesn't have his Digimon. I get it. That thing just set me flying. That's like trying to fight Mike Tyson. What's wrong with you? Everyone seems to be okay somehow. The fog has covered the entire area. There's red spider lilies at my feet. So creepy. Don't tell me he got beat up too. Oh, snap. That's not good. That is not good. They're in for a world of hurt. Is there any way they can make a break for it? Alright, what's going on? I wonder if they get saved somehow? Does like Agumon come and save him or something? Cause I know that's his like partner Digimon, right? Am I going numb or did I take a harder hit than I thought? Or is it? Another earthquake, kind of like the one from earlier. Okay, they fell into a hole. 
Interesting. Or maybe just he did. It could just be him. I tried taking a step forward and the ground crumbled underneath me. I plunged into a gaping hole that seems to pull me in. Couldn't even tell what was happening to everyone else. Unchecked development. Recent landslides. The professor's words are coming back to me. Seems like the leader struggled a little bit there, buddy. Guessing that's the beginning of the game. Takuma and Agumon. Falcomon. All right. I wish I could pronounce it, but Ao gets a uh, Labromon. Labromon. Okay. Ooh. Shuji. Lamon. Okay, that's kind of cool. It's kind of different. Saki. Definitely remember that name. Floromon. Figures. Ryu. Gets Kunemon. The one I... I always remember him from... Um, I don't know if you guys ever played Digimon. Uh, Kaido gets Dracomon. Um, and she gets... Soup. What is this? Sai... Siakoman. I pronounced that wrong for sure. But Kunemon, I always remember from Digimon Masters, I think it was called. The uh, MO from uh, from years ago, actually. I used to always get them in the very beginning. That's why I remember them. Harumi. So those were the kids from the pro prologue. That's why we haven't seen them in a cool minute. So they have to survive. I wonder if any of them, like, you know, die or something. I hate to be that guy. But I gotta say. I hear myself. The adventure begins. Right. What's that trophy? Hold on, hold on. Embark on your adventure. You know what? I'm gonna leave y'all with that. Seems like a, a good way to end it. Very climactic. The beginning of the game. And it seems like a good way to make like a the hour long of the game playing like an hour of the gameplay maybe is a good idea for a video um so like i said we'll be back thursday but i will have a video out tomorrow figure it's gonna be in the afternoon though but be on the lookout for that be on the lookout for us to continue this i see that some of these chapters are long so let me check real quick because i actually do use my action cards Hmm, I guess not. Hold on, let me check something real quick. Give me a second, give me a second. Let me bump some tunes for you guys. Um, let's see. Um, yeah, so I guess we have to beat monsters and stuff like that, like to progress. I think. I'll kind of just do them in sections because I know it's chapters but I don't really know when the chapters start and end. I guess I'll kind of look a little bit into it just kind of piece together how we're going to play this 
um like i said in the beginning i'll probably work on like a schedule thing not so much like a uh like a tuesday thursday like i'll actually put what we're gonna do on that day so i forgot what that i don't want to love i don't want to put too much pressure on myself all right other than that stay safe have yourselves a good evening and actually hold on let me do this have yourselves a good evening and i will see y'all your boy king exodus is out See, I actually can work on the transitions. <laughs>